Yo, how's it going, you guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Stafaro Gaming. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to download Panda Helper, which is a third-party app store in which you can download hacked games, you can download Plus Plus apps, and you can download games that normally would require for you to pay for them in the App Store and Google Play Store. But Panda Helper doesn't require you for, for you to pay at all. Your device does not have to be jailbroken and it does not require an Apple ID for iOS users. Um, here are some of the applications you can download, YouTube, Snapchat, Spotify, and all that, but there are way more applications than that. So first you would want to download, first you want, I'm sorry about that. First you have to click the first link in the description that will take you to this exact website. And you wanna click download for free and this will pop up. Go ahead and click install. Wait like five seconds, then go home and it'll be downloading. Just to clarify, this does work for Android and iOS users, which is just another big plus to Panda Helper. Once it's downloaded, this will pop up. If you try to open it, there's a simple method to fix this. Press cancel, go to settings, go to general, click on profiles and device management. Under Enterprise App, there will be a name. It's different for different people. I'm not sure what it's based on, but it's different. Click on that. Click Trust. Click Trust. And you're good to go. Now you're in Panda Helper. If you want notifications, click Allow. If you don't, press Don't Allow. And you're in. So I'm just going to give you guys like a bit like background of it i guess um here are the games here are the apps um you can download instagram plus plus snapchat snapchat plus plus i'm not really quite too sure what that is but lots of people like it games here are the latest games under hack there are games which are hacked for you if you like Click on one, for example, King of Thieves. The hack feature is God Mode. It doesn't give you your keys back if you get hit by a trap. The benefit of this, you could retry the stage multiple times. And yeah, if you overuse the hack on some games, you can get banned because they're actually under the original server. Um, Like, I know Clash of Clans has a private server so you won't get banned under paid is games that normally would require for you to pay but they're free like minecraft pretty pop a very popular game and yeah so that's it for this video if you guys enjoyed please leave a like and if you guys have any questions or just you guys want me to make a video on something you guys are wondering how to hack a game go ahead and leave a comment down below and i'll be replying to all of you thank you guys for watching and hopefully you guys have a wonderful new year's it's already new year's and yeah see you guys in the next video peace out